coming at you with April. Hey. Hey. <laughs> we are going to take you on a hike today, one that we will actually be able to complete because there is no rain in the forecast. Woohoo! Yeah. We are looking forward to it. One of the most popular hikes here is called Flat Top Mountain. So we are going to go to that area because there's actually quite a few trailheads in that area. So who knows if we're going to do Flat Top Mountain or something else that we can pick up in that area. But here we go. I'm pretty excited because it'll be our first summit here in Alaska. We have decided to do Flat Top Mountain, which is probably the most popular hike in the Anchorage area. It's 3.1 miles. It supposedly has amazing views. We're going up about 1,500 feet, so it's quite an elevation gain. Um, we're excited. I believe there's a reason we're here. There's a reason we're not doing Rendezvous Trail, and there's a reason that we're at Flat Top. So we're going to go check it out. If you want to come, it's a $5 per day day use. So you just pay and put the thing in your dash. Um, but we're excited to see what Flat Top Mountain has to offer. I'm sure there is a reason that it's the most popular hike in town. So it's kind of cold up here though. We are starting at 2,220 feet up. And you figure most of Alaska, well, like in Anchorage area is sea level. So we've already gone up quite a bit. And if you didn't know, every thousand feet that you climb, you lose five degrees in temperature. So we've already lost 10 degrees in temperature. I'm gonna put a hat on. After your first little climb up, which is like a quarter mile, you get up here and there's this wonderful view of Anchorage. Isn't that great? It's cold. Feels great though. And one thing you should never forget, your bear spray. There's a ton of people on this trail, so I don't suspect any issues, but bears always win. So, better safe than sorry. All these plants here up on the mountain, they're alpine plants. And we just read that while the tops may die in the winter, uh, the root system stays alive. So that is how they bloom next season. If you decide to do this, don't forget to stop and look up. It's really beautiful. And after you look up, look down. Look how far we've come. Come a long way so far. As you go up, there are lots of stairs. So if stairs are not your thing, don't do this hike. It looks like a ping pong table. Let's check it out. Oh, it's a little seating area. A loving memory of John, who would have called this the best dang bench in the world. We think we're going up here to where this flag is. What do you know? More steps. More steps. Just keep going. As you get to closer to the top, it gets really windy. Here she comes. Here it comes. Up, up, up. You get to this kind of, I don't call it plateau, but area right before this final push because there actually is a trail that goes all the way to the flag. The good news is, uh, I forgot. I forgot what the good news was. Besides the fact that, oops, I think I missed my trail. Hold on. I gotta, I gotta think what the good news is first. The final push. We did it guys, we made it to the summit.
still don't remember what the good news is. But we're going to take a walk around at the summit here for a second. We see a couple I see a couple clusters of rocks. I want to see what they are. I also heard that the view from the other side of the summit is great. So we're going to look. I will show you that's where we came from. Okay. Let's see. See that parking lot down there? That's where we started. And there is Anchorage in the distance. Downtown Anchorage. 360 degrees worth of views up here. Spectacular. Absolutely spectacular. I understand why they call it Flat Top Mountain, by the way. As you can see, I'm just walking around on a flat top. Dogs must love it up here. We've seen so many dogs. They are digging it. They love it. It is, it is quite a view. Never go anywhere without my magic binoculars. If you wanted to, you could just continue on the other side of the mountain and see that trail going down. You could just keep boop 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 boop, boop down, just like that. And now we head down, but we have to go across the flat top mountain before we go down. I think the hardest part is the last 200 feet is straight up scrambling. Sometimes use your hands. If it's raining, don't recommend this. It could get very, very slippery and the rocks are very jagged. Um, it, it's, if you're from the Vegas area and watch my videos, it reminds you of the last push on Black Mountain. So be ready for that kind of thing. But once you get to the top, easy peasy. It's great. It's actually an incredible view. So there you go. I gotta get down this. Doesn't look like much on the video for you guys, but it's a uh, it's pretty steep. So Jesus, give me a safe. Going down is uh, is rough, especially if it's wet. But as you can see, uh, this is those are people, and we went around this mountain. So it's a pretty sizable hike. It doesn't feel like three miles whatsoever. So we're gonna check the mileage and fact check that when we get back. <laughs> One of my favorite things to do when you're coming down from a mountain is to stop and turn around and look like, oh, I was there. We're stopping at the best dang bench to eat dinner. Uh, lunch. What'd she say? <laughs> if you're to from the lunch. south, you'll call it dinner anyway. Because supper is dinner. Oh. To the seven. Oh, okay. that's true. That's true. So we're sitting on the best dang bench, and it is the best dang bench because we can dangle our t our feet. Yeah. It's great. Uh, and we're gonna eat. This is a great place to eat. It's a great little bench because it's kind of got a little table, and it goes all the way around, so a bunch of people can sit if you have a large party. And it's got a great view. So let's chat. See this in the back? This is Denali National Park. This is where we're going tomorrow. So stay tuned. We learned that there is an easier way up. If you wanted to, there is a point where the trail forks. The left side is the easy side. The right side. Now I get why they put the sign there about it being difficulty trail. It wasn't just a warning that the trail is difficult. It's saying this is the option. You can have regular or difficult. And we mm. chose difficult because you're with me. Exactly. <laughs> Going down. You get to see all the Christmas trees. It's like a Christmas tree farm. It's awesome. Guys, this is a dog. I literally just thought I ran into a bear and thought I'd have to use my bear spray. <laughs> I would have used my bear spray on a dog. That would have been terrible. Check this out. This, that was the mountain we summited. See the flag on the top? It's a long way up. We did it. Yeah. You know how we usually finish videos by eating burgers and onion rings? We're not going to do that because we ate on the trail. So this is the point where we say goodbye because we're going to go shopping instead. Next best thing. <laughs> we may be adventurous and outdoors, but I mean, we're still chicks, so we need souvenirs. 
Anyway, join us tomorrow when we go to Denali. Denali National Park. We're pretty excited about that. Hope you are too. So thanks for support. Thanks for watching and see you on next adventure.